Hey everybody, this is Deanna Baker of D. Baker Designs and I wanted to talk with you a little bit about some of the things I used to do. As I was cleaning out the studio I came across some things that I used to do when the kids were little. Once I had Bella I decided to stay home and that's when I quit V Design working with Nintendo Power Magazine. It was a huge adjustment but I just couldn't put her in daycare. I just I fell in love and that's what I wanted to do. So Darren and I figured out different ways that I could stay home. Started freelancing more with graphic design and then I also met a friend um, her name was Iflin and she was from Indonesia. Her husband was a pastor of a church that we actually started going to after we met. But I met her online which is a really weird thing and she was looking for a girl model so I called her up because she was right down the road from me in Seattle and we talked and I asked her, you know, was this legit? What was she looking for? And what she did was she made these amazing clothes that she would sell on eBay. And she introduced me to this whole boutique world that was online. And during that time, I was doing artwork and staying home with the kids. And um, so I would match up these wooden purses to the outfits that she made. And she would get her patterns from Germany, um, which is a really cool company. I can put the link down below because there's just a wide range, very cool, funky looking clothes. So I started making purses, wooden purses, to match her outfits. And here's one of a circus. And the tote opens so the kids could carry their little toys, snacks, whatever they wanted to in here. And then I'll show some pictures during this that were my favorites because I started making little doll houses and for little characters that you could put with them. Um, those little squishy squashies were perfect. They made little tiny little la la loopsies when they first came out. And um, so I would make things that would match the outfits that she made. Here's a little lollipop purse. Let's see, I made this 2010 and see you put little snacks in there or something that the kids could bring along with them. Then I started making these cute little doll totes. Instead of having little doll houses and things like that, I made a little doll tote. This is a Halloween little witch. It says trick or treat on here. And then see you open it up and there's always little details in there that uh, I love to do. This one cracks me up because she has feather hair. And this is Frankenstein. Stein's bride, I guess you'd say. Um, a little heart in there. Just enough for little snacks or a little toy. And these also my favorite. I love these guys. Uh, for some reason, I started loving dolls, making dolls, the older I got. And I had a couple when I was younger, but it was, you know, not crazy. I actually was more of a tomboy and liked to play with cars and uh, the Barbie car. I remember I had the Corvette, the RV. I had this cool kit looking car that I could program, but for some reason, as an adult, I love dolls. Weird. Isn't he cute though? So, and then I started sewing clothes as well because I, I, I would do that for my kids, but never, you know, selling online. And Iflin kind of showed me the way. Her name was Jolie B on eBay back in the day before everything switched to Facebook. Now there's different groups and things like that. I've kind of fallen away over the years, which is kind of sad because I loved doing this stuff. So this was made from um, a sweater, very soft uh, sweater and some material. Then what we do is we take t-shirts and upcycle them. And then I actually made this fabric here and drew these little things on there to match. Took different fabrics and this was a t-shirt that I made it from. Isn't it cute? These are little arm warmers. And I used to make monster hats back in the day before they were in all the stores, which I see now. Um, this was for my son. Just another, actually these were pajama bottoms that I took the bottoms and made them into sleeves. Little Aquaman. And I always loved the little fairy type hoods. So, a lot of this, um, I'm going to start listing because it's, it's kind of sad that it's just sitting here. 
This is a cute one. A little rockabilly outfit. And I made this graphic of um, Johnny Cash. And I drew all this out on the computer in Illustrator and then did it as an iron-on. And then made it into a dress for summer. Isn't that cute? This was a sweet one. This is one of the first ones I did to sell. And then it's got a little apron. It looks very country. And I'll show you the picture of Bella. This is her modeling it. And then this one is so sweet. Because it's so soft, warm, looks snuggy buggy. This is a flannel type material down here with the little boo-boo balls. Again, upcycled from a t-shirt.